Hey guys, Nathan here. Welcome back to another video. Today I have another Lego haul from eBay and Lego Shop at Home. I uh, went out the other day and got a Jordan Love jersey from the uh, Packer Pro Shop at Lambeau. Obviously everyone knows about Aaron Rodgers leaving. Uh, as of right now filming this, it's not official. Like, it's not official, but we all know he's going to go to the Jets. Um, I've always been a huge believer in uh, supporting your QB no matter who it is. Obviously, my whole life it's been Aaron Rodgers, but there's been times when he's been injured, um, and I supported our backups. Uh, so I didn't buy their jerseys because I knew it was temporary, but this is obviously very permanent. We drafted Jordan Love, uh, and I have full faith that he's going to be a good quarterback for us. Uh, so yeah, with this, I'm going to do Lego Shop at Home first. Uh, weird story behind this. This got shipped uh, to my old address somehow. I can't find anywhere in my information that my old address is still connected to my account uh but i placed the order and then i kind of forgot about it and i thought hmm this is weird why haven't i got my shipment and i'm looking at my princess leia thing and i noticed that my my file is on here wrong but uh i looked at the shipment and i thought this is weird it uh it should have been shipped by now and i checked uh, or i should it should have been delivered and i thought that's weird it hasn't been delivered yet so I checked the package and it, uh, the shipping, and it showed that it was delivered um, to my old address. So we called up uh, the owner of the house now. We're still in contact with him. He didn't see a package. Um, he didn't remember getting a package, and he wasn't at the home at the time. I think they were out of town. Uh, so I contacted Lego and said, we have a lost package. I don't know if it was stolen. Uh, the owner of the new home can't find the package. So they sent me a new shipment. And like two days later, the a homeowner called and said, oh, never mind, we just got back and I found it on the front porch. It looks like it's getting kind of wet because of the snow. Luckily, nothing was damaged. The box was kind of faded, but nothing inside it was damaged. Uh, so if I get a second shipment, I am going to contact Lego and see what I should do. If they want me to send it back, I'm not obviously going to take what I have here for free because that's stealing. Um, and I wouldn't feel good about that. So I'll see what Lego does. I'll contact them and say, hey. But it's odd because it's been like two weeks since I sent that message. I've had this package sitting here for a while and I haven't gotten a new one. So maybe they, the guy said I sent out a new one, but maybe they think I'm BSing and I was lying, which I wasn't at the time. I did not know this package existed. I thought it was stolen or lost or the homeowner was lying and still had the package. So I sent in a request for a new one. They said they sent one out, but it's been two weeks. So maybe they actually didn't. Uh, so with that, I will get into this. Uh, first thing is uh, Buzz Lightyear from Toy Story. This brickhead's been out for a while, and I just never got my hands on it. I came out last year. Uh, 40552, 114 pieces. Obviously, Buzz Lightyear. So uh, I think that completes all the Disney and Pixar ones I would like. Uh, yeah, and I think this was on clearance as well. I think it was like. I'm not quite sure. Maybe this is 15 and it's, it was, I think it was like 11 or something. Um, and then the freebie you got if you spent over a certain amount uh, was this moving truck, which I think is really cool. Uh, 40586, the moving truck, 301 pieces. A little sticker on the truck says storage and transfer, which I think is really cool and probably fits with me very well because I load up uh, delivery trucks all the time. Obviously, it's not a moving truck, so maybe not not so much because um, my the trucks I load up at my job don't involve moving; they just involve deliveries. Uh, so the set that I got to get to that was uh, the A-frame cabin. So uh, two one three three eight, the A-frame cabin Lego Ideas set number forty six, um, and you get one, two, I think four mini gears total. Yeah. Um, so I think it's a really cool set. I can't wait to build this. I don't know if I'm going to build this here or uh, when I move out. I'm kind of getting a, a huge backlog of Lego sets due to the fact that I'm living here and I've kind of built what will fit on the shelf and I don't want to take a whole bunch of time uh, taking sets apart here and swapping out sets because uh, this is obviously isn't a permanent home. I've been here for about two and a half months now, three months. Um, I actually found apartments so hopefully I have a plan to move in there. I need to contact um, contact the people that own the apartments. It looks like there's two available right now. I um, actually got word from my coworkers who used to stay at them. Uh, she said when her and her husband got married, they stayed at these apartments. They're really nice, a good amount of room. Uh, probably at the two bedroom, one bath. Uh, 
it's a reasonable price that I'm okay with. So we will look at that. Uh, but that was the little order. And I need to get boxes out of here because this room is filling up with cardboard boxes. Uh, so I will do the smallest package first. Um, so one of these is a pretty normal set. Uh, I would say a pretty normal set, but one that I didn't see that often. I see they just sent it in paper, of course, the one set that normally costs a lot and kind of did in this instance. I think I paid 60 for it. Um, come on. I hate it when <laughs> it turns out to be a set that costs a little bit more than I'm willing to pay and then the person only wraps it in paper. I feel like the edges of this box are going to be damaged. But, let me see here. Yeah, I'm trying to be as careful as I can, but it's hard when all they do is wrap it in. Um, all they do is wrap it in thin paper, but as you can see, it is Caden Speedo Bike, which... I don't know the story on this one, but... I don't know if this was an excuse to... A certain store or what but um, really trying to be careful here I didn't want to pay $60 for this but it was the cheapest listing I saw um, actually it did not get beat up actually that worked I guess in this instance it only took a lot of effort to get it open a small crease here, but no biggie. Um, so yeah, Canon Speeder Bike from 2016. Uh, I know this Imperial Combat Driver is a foil pack and that this set and that foil pack are the only set it comes in, but um, for a Combat Driver, I just can't imagine why the set was so much. So 75141 Canon Speeder Bike, 234 pieces. You get the Combat Driver, a Stormtrooper, and Canon. So yeah, I, I think it was... I think I won the listing for 45 and then there was $15 shipping. And I might have scratched the box while cutting it open. Um, but yeah, so I remember seeing this set in stores and I just never bought it. And uh, I think it was 25 or 30 when it came out, so the price on that doubled. Uh, but I've seen some go for over 100 um, And there was a bidding for it, and not many people were bidding on it. And oh, this is. I thought this was another set. This is this is what I need to call them about them because this is my replacement stuff that uh, I'm not supposed to have. So yeah, we'll have to see what we do about this. But here's another uh, moving van and that. So that stinks because I got to contact Lego now. I thought maybe they just didn't send it. Um, but this one should be from eBay and isn't. This hopefully is not another A-frame cabin. Uh, let me move this out. I believe this is a set from... I got a notification that a set, a set was delivered. So hopefully that is the case. Let's see. What in the world? <laughs> That's why. I don't remember ordering this many sets. So I actually bought uh, three sets from the same seller. I don't have another package, do I? No. I thought I had one more. Okay, so this guy was, uh, I was on eBay and I could see that there was a whole bunch of photos of sets in the same exact back backdrop. Uh, a whole bunch of Star Wars sets that I already owned. But I noticed it was a high quantity of sets, so I went through this guy's all this guy's listings. I could tell it was the same person, and I found some that he was selling, and I actually bought three sets, won three different bids. So I got two advent calendars. This is the 75146 um, advent calendar from, what year was this one? 2016, so I just saw another listing for this one because it's got the white uh, Christmas Chewbacca. Uh, but yeah, this one... I guess it doesn't really show all the minifigures in it. You get a white Chewbacca, a Luke, looks like a Bespin pilot. 
a Hoth Trooper, Battle Droid, either a C-3PO or an Astromech, a Rebel Trooper, uh, kind of a lot of stuff happening here. So that is the 2016 Advent Calendar. And then I also got the, this is the 2015 Advent Calendar. So the year before, 75097, 292 pieces. You get C-3PO as Santa Claus, R2-D2 as a reindeer, a Stormtrooper, a Rebel Trooper. Looks like a Jawa. Ooh, this one kind of shows all of it. I think that might be the only minifigures. You get a probe droid, star destroyer, a wing. Uh, oh, and you get an Ewok. So really cool little build of the Sarlacc, I think. Uh, so yeah, obviously these aren't anything I need to open. If there's any set specifically I don't need to open, like this is versus Kane and Speedo bike. Uh, I don't need to open an advent calendar from, you know, five six years ago. And then the last set I got, these are all new. Uh, this was one that. <laughs> Is like a huge mistake on Lego's part for making this set because it was incorrect the way they made it. Uh, but I think it completes my Force Awakens set. Uh, this is Kylo Ren's shuttle. So brand new, the one from 2015. Yep. Because uh, the color into this is wrong. The ship is black. And then the wings, uh, they fold, I think, in instead of out or out instead of in. Um, but yeah, this is just, yeah, it's they're in instead of out and they're supposed to. Yeah, in instead of out, yeah. So just a set that they, the color in it, on it is wrong. Uh, so I paid 100 for this, and then I paid 35 for each advent calendar, which I was okay with. I wanted to pay 100 or less for this, and I got it for 100, and it's brand new. So again, a Star Wars set brand new for $100 like this. You can't say no, because it was a $100 set, so I didn't pay anything more. Uh, I didn't want to pay more just due to the fact that it's like such an incorrect set. Uh, with the coloring and the uh, overall how the ship works itself. So yeah, this is from 2015, 75104, Kylo Ren's Command Shuttle, 1,005 pieces. Uh, you get a First Order Officer, General Hux, Kylo Ren, a First Order Stormtrooper Officer, and two First Order Crew. Um, I don't know, maybe the minifigures are rare or something along the lines of that. Um, but yeah, that is another Lego haul. I noticed that I'm doing my, um, my clip art for my... Um, backdrops for my videos I noticed I should just stack up sets and take a picture of it instead of doing all this extra clip art uh, but that is my Lego haul I was expecting one more package uh, which I guess I can say now is the MTT from I think it was 2007 a very rare set someone was selling it used um, I think I paid 200 for it one of those where you could tell it was in like a Mac excuse me, immaculate condition. Oh, I get these weird hiccups in the middle of my videos always, no other time. Uh, but yeah, I'll have to contact Lego about this because it's weird that I got the promo in this scent, but I didn't get the, the big set scent. Uh, but even this itself is, I mean, this is a promo, so I don't know about this, but I want to send it back because it doesn't feel right having two of a set that isn't, I wasn't supposed to get two, it was a mistake. Uh, but yeah, so I have the MTT coming. Um, I might have honestly left boxes somewhere in this room that I don't know about because I swear I had, I also had the Technic Battle Droid. Uh, so I might have a box laying around here that I forgot about that I will see later and then go, oops, that was supposed to be in the video. Uh, but I did have the MTT and the uh, Super or the Battle Droid Technic set coming. Uh, which was another one that I saw uh, new for $75 and I jumped on it because another one that I see go for like 100 and the MTT is like that one I see uh, new it goes for upwards seven eight hundred dollars used up to four or five hundred so I'm lucky that the bidding didn't go past 200 and then I got it for 200 plus whatever the shipping was and there's a lot of instances where I find sets that I really want that I am missing. Um, like, actually, I saw Kylo Ren's Command Shuttle a while ago, and it was like $65 new, and no one was bidding on it, and the bidding was about to end, and I was like, whoa. So I opened it, and then I looked at the shipping. $98 shipping. Well, that goes from $60 to 140 or 150 just like that, because you're adding almost $100 of shipping. 
Um, it, sometimes it's weird. I'll think, oh, it's from California. They'll be in like Utah. I'm like, why is it $100 shipping to ship it from Utah to Wisconsin? That's not $100 shipping. I don't know if it's the box size or what, but um, yeah, I'm not going to pay 90 Like if, if the bidding was only $20 and $98 shipping, okay, then I'm paying 118 that's a little more reasonable, but the higher the shipping, the higher the bidding gets, you you gotta add a hundred dollars onto that because you're gonna pay a hundred dollars more for the shipping plus the tax. You're paying a hundred and five hundred and ten dollars more, um, and that's just a ridiculous price. I'm not willing to pay. So, yeah, there's my Lego haul. I got some extras that I'm gonna have to contact Lego about um, and see what they want me to do. If they tell me uh, don't worry about it, then obviously I will. I don't I don't know keep them part them out use the pieces I don't know what but um I'm sure Lego will tell me to send it back but we'll see what they say so that is my Lego haul I hope you guys enjoyed thank you for watching the video hit the thumbs up subscribe have a great day